Welcome back to the channel today. I'm going to show you a quick video on how to light and operate a vent free gas heater. I uh, know it's probably um, sounds like it's a simple process, which it is. It's, there's nothing to it, but I'm sure there's somebody out there that might not know how to do it. So I'm going to show you. So if you look on the top of your heater, you have pilot off and then you got one through five or you might even have uh, more numbers here but mine has one through five and what you're going to want to do is you have an arrow right here and this arrow you're going to turn it to pilot see right to pilot pointing okay all the way to pilot and i'm going to try to do this with uh, one hand here and hold the camera but you hold the pilot light down as you can see you have nothing lit yet pilot light down and now you're going to hit your igniter and as soon as you hit your igniter the flame's going to go now mind you i'm still holding this button down okay and once the uh the um thermocoupler gets uh hot it'll stay on you just keep it held down for maybe a minute or less and I'm gonna go ahead and release my uh, hand from here just like that and as you can see the flame is still lit so now that's just your pilot light you see we're just on pilot okay so your one through five is your settings we're gonna turn this all the way say we got it on one right now and it doesn't do anything but that's because it's uh, already that warm in the house. That's a thermostat. There's a thermostat in there. So we'll move it to two. One, two. Still, it just it's reading that it's too warm in the house for it to come on at that temperature. So we're gonna move it to three. Now it isn't uh, it isn't that warm in the house, so. The thermostat says, hey, we need some heat. We're turned up high. And that's the way that it uh, that it works. It's pretty simple. And then now uh, them flames will die down once it uh, once it burns for a little while there. It'll die down. But now that's only on three. Now we have two more settings there. And I keep mine on three. I heat my house with uh, with three of these things. Um, and it heats my house perfectly fine. Now, one thing you're going to want to do with, um, if you burn just these heaters to, to heat your house, is you're going to want to run a dehumidifier uh, because this heat, it's good heat, but uh, it also is like a, uh, it's got a lot of moisture in it. And if you don't run a dehumidifier, you'll notice you'll have moisture on your windows or on your walls and then once you know you have that on there it is going to cause you to have um, like mildew or mold or whatever it is um, a lot of condensation comes off this heat so you have to run dehumidifier um, I do and it works perfectly fine and also another thing you're going to want to do with having a natural gas heater is you're going to want to um, you're going to want to run, um, ha make sure you have the, uh, uh, what are they called? The uh, carbon monoxide detectors. I have three of them in my house because um, you want to be safe with it. Uh, you know, messing with anything with gas, you're going to definitely want to have a carbon monoxide detector. But, um, yeah, other than that, that's as simple as it is nothing to it i did want to just make this video just, i'm sure there's somebody out there that might not know exactly how to light a gas heater and that's why i made it um, and then if you want to shut it down say it gets too hot in here you just move the dial down to two it's shut off depending on how hot or cold it is outside you can move it to one and it'll come on whenever the house gets too cold or you can set it to pilot and I normally keep mine on pilot if it's like say 
60s outside um, you don't want it to be real hot and believe it or not that little that little flame puts off a little bit of heat and it does pretty good but then if you want to uh, shut it completely off turn it to the off position and your flame goes out pretty simple so I would like to tell you thanks for watching the video and uh, give me a thumbs up comment subscribe appreciate all the subs and uh, we'll see you on the next one